اس پر کے مسل لیا جاتا ہے الحمد للہ وی آر سو گریٹ فل ٹو اللہ سبحانہ و تعالی اللہ سبحانہ و تعالی سو کائنڈلی گیو اس دا ویری اسپیشل مان اس مان تو فرما دا سو مان تو فرما دا الحمد للہ وی اولریڈی پاس 22 ڈیز اونلی ایٹ ڈیز اور نائن ڈیز لیفٹ سو فاسٹ اینڈ ڈیز اللہ سبحانہ و تعالیٰ گئی بس سو مینی بلیسنگ اینڈ ریوارڈ ریوارڈ اللہ سبحانہ فاسٹ اینڈ ڈیز فصل اسلام سے سے اول رحمت فاسٹ اینڈ ڈیز اللہ سبحانہ و تعالیٰ گئی بس سو مینی مینی ریوارڈ اینڈ میڈل ٹین ڈیز وہ آوسا تو ہوں مف کی رہتے ہیں میڈل ٹین ڈیز اللہ سبحانہ و تعالیٰ گئی بس جا جنرلی اللہ سبحانہ تعالیٰ فور گیت اس سو مینی پیٹس دوز ہوا سیک فور گیتنس تو اللہ سبحانہ تعالیٰ اللہ سبحانہ فور گیت کرتا ہے ان لاسٹ ٹین ڈے وی انٹر دا لاسٹ ٹین ڈے لاسٹ ٹین ڈے اللہ سبحانہ و تعالیٰ ویل فور گیت دوز کائنڈ او پیٹل دوز ہوا لیسٹڈ تو ویل ہیت انٹر دا ہیل This kinds of people, if he seek forgiveness to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will forgive him. So, today, I am recited one, one complete surah, it's called Surah Tawbukha. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala revealed one complete surah. When our beloved Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam was in Mecca, Then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala revealed the complete surah is called Surah Al-Fadr. Inna anzalna hu fi layla tilqad. Inna anzalna, we have revealed the Quran. This blessing night is night called is night of decree, night of power. It's called Layla Tilqadr. Then last, our beloved Prophet Muhammad Rasulullah, O oh my Prophet, وَمَا أَدْرَاكَ مَا لَيْلَةُ الْقَدْرِ Do you know what is the Laylatul Qadr? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala asked question to our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Do you know what is the Laylatul Qadr? <coughs> Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala giving answer, reply. Laylatul Qadri khairu min al-fisha. Laylatul Qadr is better than thousand man. So subhanahu <laughs> Allah said, replied to him again, O oh Muhammad, Laylatul Qadr is Khairun bin Al-Fisha, better than thousand man. Tanazzalul Malaikati wa Ruh. That night, the night of Laylatul Qadr, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala descended the Malaika and Ruh. تَنَزَّلُ الْمَلَائِكَةِ وَالْرُوحِ فِيهَا بِإِذْنِ رَبِّهِمْ مِنْ كُلِّ عَمْ فِيهَا بِإِذْنِ رَبِّهِمْ مِنْ كُلِّ عَمْ By the permission of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala take the so many important decision in this night It's called Laylatul Another quote in the name of this light the Laylatul uh, Hikmah, like take the decision, this, the Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala takes so many decisions in this night. <coughs> so, Tanazzar al-Malaika to your roof, Fiha bi-izni rabbihim min kulli am, Salamun hiya hatta matla ilfaj. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala revealed the one very special niyama, blessings and mercy on this night, It will continue at the matla al-fajr, two fajr. It will start from sunset to two fajr. So in the whole night, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala revealed to us a special niyama, a special blessings and mercy on this night. So, In the first ayat, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Inna anzalna hu fi laylatil qadr. In another ayat, 
We've got in the Surah Al-Baqarah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, Shahru Ramadan al-Lazi unzila fihi Qur'an. This is the month which is, we have revealed the Qur'an. The Qur'an, the, one of the great source of all kinds of, kinds of blessings and mercy. All kinds of blessings and mercies, Qur'an is the one of the station. So this night Allah subhanahu wa revealed the Qur'an, that means Qur'an is the one station of all kinds of good fortune, good luck, and all kinds of blessings and mercy in the Qur'an. This Qur'an Allah revealed in this night. So this night, it is our uh, duty to, we will decide as many times, as much you know the recitation of Qur'an. And we will do the external for ibadah, as many rakhat if possible for you. Then Prophet said, you do dua this night as many times. Like few few minutes you decide the, if you like half, half an hour you decide the Qur'an Sharif, then you stop Qur'an Sharif. Then do one dua to Allah subhanahu wa you, re, you recite the extra tasbih, the tahlil. The tasbih is very, very important tasbih. This night, as much you can, one of the very important tasbih is the hadith of the last hadith of Bukhari Sharif. Last hadith of Bukhari Sharif, what is it? Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, one this tasbih, it is very easy to spell with your mouth. If you keep it in scale, it will be very, very strongable thing if you keep in the uh, in the in the scale. What it is? It's the subhanallah bihamdi, subhanallah. This is the last hadith of Bukhari. So, if you read, read this, this tasbih, then this is a very, very strong, powerful tasbih for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The whole tasbih are praising for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So, this tasbih, if you read, inshallah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will give you more, more reward, inshallah. And another tasbih, if you read the Allah Akbar, Allah Akbar, Subhanallah, Bihamdi, Subhanallah, and if you take the another uh, uh, name of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, like Ya Latifu, Ya Latifu, Ya Latifu, Ya Razzaku, Ya Razzaku, Ya Razzaku, Ya Khaliku, Ya Khaliku, Ya Khaliku. As many times. So this blessed night, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, it was fixed. It was fixed. But Prophet when he came to the mosque to say that this bless, which day this blessed night, when he entered the mosque and he saw that the few uh, companions they are going, the Prophet he was forgot the which day the, uh, this day. But Allah Subhanahu wa Taala is fixed at this day. This is the another hikmah as well. So the, those people are sinful people. If he knows this day is the Laylatul Qadr, he will live the whole year. So he will not do the, any kinds of ibadah, any kinds of uh, uh, good deeds the whole year. So that's why Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala hide it. That's why Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala hide it. And Prophet Muhammad Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam Said, when come the twentieth uh, twentieth of uh, Ramadan, every single odd night you can find you can find the Shlaylatul uh, uh, Qadr. The odd, odd night is which is twenty one. Number one is twenty one of Ramadan. Then twenty three of Ramadan. Then twenty five of Fifth of Ramadan, then twenty seventh of Ramadan. 
then 29th of Ramadan. This five days, it is possibility 100%, if you do this night ibadah, must be, you will meet this night. So, when Prophet is uh, talking about the speciality of this night, our mother Aisha Siddiqa radiallahu ta'ala, she asked the question, Ya Rasulullah, if I meet this night, what, what dua should I do on the subhanahu wa ta'ala? Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa said, you do, Allahumma innaka tuhibbun. Allahumma innaka afun. Tuhibbu lafa, fa'afu anni. The true narration we got. This is the one narration. Another narration is, Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa said, Allahumma innaka afun. Tuhibbu lafa, fa'afu anni ya kadhi. The both of you can hear. What is the meaning it is? Allahumma inna kafu. Wallah, you are so kind and blessed. You have so many, you have so kind, uh, so kind and blessed. So, tuhibbu lafa, you love forgiving the people. So please forgive me. So this kind of dua, dua if you do, inshallah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will forgive us. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give us so many rewards in this dunya in the day of judgment. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give us the ability to do more ibadah in this blessed night. Inshallah, we will discuss about more inshallah. Uh, so Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, inshallah, accept our all kinds of ibadah. Jazakallah khairan. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. So, uh, another uh, respected Muslim, another uh, request to you, uh, another Hanslow. Hanslow Muslim community, they, are, um, they bought the one church, the very big amount. And they hold the complete uh, the whole day. Uh, <coughs> the house of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Inshallah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala reward you. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give you more and more jazah, inshallah.